Welcome, everyone, to another Pokemon TC Dev and Day. We're looking at Cinderace VMAX from Rebel Clash. Yes, I, I don't mind Cinderace. It was, I think, it was my second favorite start of Sword and Shield. First being, obviously, Rillaboom, hashtag the Goofy Gang. Um, but yeah, Cinderace, I like Cinderace. I can't really complain. Um, and VMAX is no exception. I like the V card as well. Um, 320 HP is kind of that normal VMAX HP that we see. It's, it's all right. Can't really complain. It's pretty good. Fire type, which means you get things at your disposal, like Fire Crystal to withdraw your energy, Heat Factory to get. Uh, more draw for energy, you get giant half to search for energy, you get welder to attach and draw, you've got a lot of things for fire types right now, you've got a lot of things. Um, and you also get weakness on Zacian, which is great. We love getting weakness on Zacian, it's amazing. Retreat cost, uh, retreat cost of two, sorry about that, I got a bit tongue tied, uh, is great because then you get things at your disposal like air balloon, so that's great. Um, weakness to water is not too bad, really. It's not. It's not that big of a deal. You might see Inteleon run around. You might see a couple of Frostmoth decks run around, but majority of it, well, pretty much all water type cards are either weakness to lightning, which Peak Rom is going to get rid of, or steel, which Zacian is going to get rid of. So yeah, water types aren't really seeing that much of play as you'd think. Uh, it's got two attacks. First off is counter. For one fire, one colorless energy does 30 damage, but if this Pokemon was damaged by an attack during your opponent's last turn, this attack does that much more damage, which is amazing. We like to see that. That is great. And we also have, for two fire and one colorless energy, we have max power of all. 170 damage, but your opponent's active Pokemon is now burnt, which is basically 190, which is great. Like that, I can't complain. It's pretty good. It's, it's not bad. But of course, Cinderace VMAX is not alone. We're going to see who he's paired up with today. First off, we have Entei. Now, the whole point of Cinderace VMAX is that he's supposed to tank Hitch as much as possible, and then by the time he gets knocked out, we're supposed to have someone either backing him up, either the next Cinderace VMAX or Entei. For one fire, one colors energy, rally back, 30 damage, but if any of your Pokemon were knocked out by damage from an opponent's attack during the last turn, it does 120 instead. So it's literally a combat card. Entei is literally just a nice little combat card. It's it's just a one-off. It, it's great. I like Entei. Entei's alright. We've seen cards like this before anyway, but you know, it's great. It's fine. We also have one copy of Cinderace, uh, Lever of Cinderace from Sword and Shield. Uh, again, I like the Cinderace. Uh, once during your turn, when this Pokemon moves from the bench to the active, you take two fire energy from your discard and attach it to Cinderace. Cinderace. And then for two fire, one colorless, Flare Striker, 190, discard two energy. It's literally just there to do a blitz of damage for one or two times. That's literally it. That, that's it. It's kind of a backup attacker, but normally Cinderace is kind of there to pick up the pieces. So yeah, we're, we're all right. We're, we're okay. We also have one copy of Eldegoss. Uh, put it on your hand, search for support from discard pile and put it into your hand. Eldegoss is great. We love Eldegoss. And we, of course, we have two copies of Dedede. Now, everyone knows what Dedede does by now. Anyone who's been here long enough, say it with me now. When you get Dedede, put it on your bench, discard your hand, draw six. We love Dedede. Dedede is great. We also have two copies of Jirachi. Everyone knows what Jirachi does as well. Uh, top five cards, get a trainer card, can be item, support, stadium, or tool card. And put it into your hand, Drachi falls asleep. Everyone knows what Drachi does, Drachi is amazing. And we also have in DDV. To heal up damage for Cinderace V Max, it, it does heal up by 20, but 20 damage does go a long way. So yeah, in DD, don't mind, DD's fine. We also have two copies of Fire Crystal, one Great Catcher, one Pokemon Communications, four Quick Balls, one Rare Candy, one Super Scoop Up, three Switches, two Giant Hearts, one Heat Factory, two Boss Orders, one Cynthia and Caitlyn, two Mallow and Anna, two Marnie, one Professor Research, four Welder, two Skateboard, three Giant Bomb. Now this one is a doozy. Now I was thinking what tool card should I add and definitely Giant Bomb is the one. So if the Pokemon this card is attached to takes 180 or more damage from an opponent's attack, even if it means it's knocked out, you put 10 damage counters on the attacking Pokemon. This is great for a number of things. First off, it does great for Cinderace VMAX because not only do you do a do you put 100 damage on your opponent's Pokemon, you do the 180 minimum plus the 30 that you originally do. So altogether, you could do a maximum of 310 damage. Yeah, you're pretty much knocking out every tag team at least. That is an easy three prize. That is amazingly easy. And the meta cards right now normally would take 180, besides obviously Picarom's Full Blitz and Dragapult's, um, I think Max Max Phantasm, is that what it is? I think it's Max Phantasm. But yeah, other than that, Zacian will do 230, so Giant Bomb's in effect. Uh, ADP with Alter Creation will do 180, so that's in effect as well. Again, it's great, I can't really complain. It's amazing. So yeah, Giant Bomb, great, love it. And we also have 12 Fire Energy. So with that being said, let's get into it. I'm pretty excited for this. Let's go. Okay, so Psychic, Dragon, Steel. Most likely Ultra Necrozma. Most likely. Which is fine. It's a nice little easy thing. 
Right, let's coin flip. It's not too bad. We're, we're okay. If we get well done, that's amazing. So hopefully things go well. Right, Cinderity Max. It's not exactly the card I wanted to start off with. I always hate mulligans that show off your best card, that show off literally the main card of it. I always hate that. Like, because before you could be like, ah, oh, okay, well, you can kind of like hide it sort of thing. Do you know what I mean? You can kind of just hide the card that you're using and just be on your way. But just when it's when it actually shows off the main card that you're using, it's just like, well, they know what deck I'm using now, so I, I can literally just play around with it. Right, Giratina. Okay. Okay, so straight up discard that's fine um if that's the case then shut down the draw i suppose um i should have done giant half afterwards but that's fine because normally in the in tcg online you you reshuffle but you could still get the same cards i guess that can work in real life anyway but it's, it's really rare because like literally we had we had the rainbow rare cinderace in our mulligan and then it's come up again which is weird but you know what it's fine might as well attach to Ente while we're here. Then Marnie, pop this, pop everything off, because he might have something very bad. I know with like eight cards, you must have something, but. Right, double Dedene, Welder. We have Elder Goss somewhere in here. Um, yeah, I can, we can use Dedene. We can mess around. We can mess around with Dedene. Discard your hand, draw six. Okay, so we got quick ball. Um, I guess we get rid of communication since we don't have any other Pokemon. Um, next time we can get giant half, we've got boss's orders, we, we should be all right. Um, yeah, I'm gonna say get Jirachi. Actually, should we get Elder Goss instead? I think it, I think Elder Goss would be a better idea because then we can get that Entei back. Maybe keep Elder Goss in our hand for now, because I don't really know what would happen afterwards, but keep Elder Goss in our hand for now. Yeah. Because you might not know, he might pop a Marnie. He might just pop Marnie and then, then we'll be in a tight situation. So hopefully we should be alright. Yeah, how are you guys doing today actually? I haven't asked that question today. How are you guys doing? I'm doing pretty good actually. It is hot today. It is extremely hot today. Like, oh, it's profusely hot. But uh, just just coping, I suppose. Um, right, that's a good thing for us. He's got no draw support. He's got nothing like that. Giant Hearth. Get rid of the two. Swap it for Heat Factory. Get even more draw. I love that combination of just. I, I suppose it does get rid of like your. Um, it does get rid of your what's it called? Like stadium, but it's a nice way of like thinning the deck out and getting more draw. I like. I just love that combination. Um, right. Well, we can get rid of Inkay. Well, actually, no, we won't be able to actually because we need to, we either do well or get the attachment draw three. If that's the case, then I might as well just use Elder Ghost to get Welder back. Mm. Yeah, get Welder back. Be lovely. Get Welder back, be lovely. Use Welder, attach it to Cinderace, draw three, attach to Entei, and then pop off the 30. Next time, pop off one more Entei, and then we could just do one, do 100, then that's two hit KO on Garatina, which is perfectly fine. Um, oh my boy, connection's been really bad. The connection's been awful. What is going on? Right, so let's see. Well done. Oh my gosh, the connection's been awful. But yeah, it's just, going back to what I said earlier, it has been hot today. It's been extremely hot. Like, I can't even, I can't even deal, like, I mean, I don't mind the summer. Summertime's just amazing for me, but my god, dude, it's so hot. I guess it's because, like, because we're at the top floor, and it's just, it, it's really, it's just, because heat rises, it's just really weird. It's just really strange. Like, downstairs, like, if you go, like, downstairs, it's really cool. Um, I live in a story house, by the way, so it's just, it, it's really, it's really just, it's a bit difficult at points, because everything that I have to record is upstairs. And it just makes it so much harder. It makes it so much harder. Um, right, do I sacrifice the Heat Factory? Actually, yeah, sacrifice the Heat Factory. Might as well. Sacrifice the Fire Energy, because then that way we could at least get something. We've got switches. Um, so technically, we can pop off with Cinderace. Um, so yeah, that could work. I could even get Quick Ball to get a Jirachi. Pop a switch. Get Fire Crystal. And then switch it back. Never mind. Got Fire Crystal anyway. Um, I'm gonna say. Oh gosh, what will I say? 
Actually, you know what? Maybe not get quick ball right now. Actually, no, yeah, with the fire crystal, get three energy back. Use quick ball, get rid of another fire energy. Get Jirachi, pop switch, see what I get, and then pop off Cinderace, knock out. Cool. Sweet. Sweet as. Right, then, yeah. Energy on Cinderace. When it wants to do it, quick ball, get rid of a fire energy. Right, and then Jirachi, pop a switch. I always, I don't know, like, I keep seeing Cinderace be max, right? And I see it, and I'm just like, I want to make a decent deck out of this, because why would you not? 320 HP is great, because not many cards can get rid of it, unless, of course, you're hitting for weakness. Like, Lapras V Max could probably take it out in, like, easy runnings. Um, but Zacian won't. Zacian get rid of Cinderace V, but not V Max, which is great. Um, even with Alter Creation, which just makes it worse for them in the long run. Um, it's just, it's, I don't know, why would you not use Cinderace V-Max? I guess because, like, you don't know what exactly you're going to be hitting. Um, you know, let's get, well, actually, no, no one can hit us that quickly for uh, over 100. Well, I don't think anyone in this deck can hit us for over 180. Um, maybe just keep Mellow and Lana for now, I suppose. Right, and then pop another switch. Because we just wasn't going to get a skateboard. If we had a skateboard, that would have been great, but I don't think we do. Right, then Cinderace, pop for 140. Sweet. There we go. Another giant bomb, which is perfectly fine. Boss's orders, snuff out. Oh, okay, well, I guess snuff out the Necrozma then, because it's pretty much useless with. There you go. Right, sweet. Next game. Let's go. Okay, so grass and colorless. So we should have advantage. Should. Doesn't mean that we will. So, right. Okay, obviously lost the flip. That's perfectly fine. That's perfectly fine. So if we start off with Cinderace, it's going to be amazing. Nope, enter again. Heat Factory or Giant Hearth. We've got one choice of the two. Hmm. We've got one or two choices. We could either go for more draw. My best bet would be if we don't get Welder, then use Heat Factory. If we don't get Welder in this next draw, then get then use Heat Factory. If we do, then use Giant Hearth, get rid of, I'm going to say, Boss's Orders. And then use Welder, get the 100. Hmm. Okay, so rather than Executor, Cynthia Caitlin, obviously, as you do. Fire Crystal. Okay. Um, well, I'm gonna. Well, I could do Heat Factory, get rid of Fire Energy, and then use Fire Crystal to get it back, which would be just easier. So let's try that. So draw, draw, draw. Well, double. Same thing, Caitlyn, though. Marnie as well. Not really anyone that I needed, but. Okay. Well. Right, so I'm gonna do Cynthia and Caitlyn because that's the only decent draw. I know uh, we should have done Marnie, but should have most likely done Marnie, but I don't know if that would have been better for him. Uh, Cinderace, which is nice. Um, right, Ugh, definitely next turn has to be Marnie. Yeah, definitely next turn has to be Marnie. It has to be Marnie. Right. Um, okay, so then next turn, yeah, Marnie. Then, gosh, yeah, it, it has to be. It really has to be. Right, okay, there's a weakness energy. That's going to be a tad bit of an issue. It's going to be a slim issue. Okay. Another Cinderace. 
Um, okay, heat factory. Give me something decent, man. I need something. I need something cool. I need something nice. I need something decent. Give me something cool to play with. Come on, I need something nice to play with. Come on, give me something. Give me something. Dede. I mean, quick ball for. Boss's orders? I might have to get rid of the other Dedene, actually. I might have to get rid of the other Dedene. Right, Jirachi, Jirachi, get me Welder. Please, please, please get me Welder. Right, Jirachi on the bench, pop a switch, get Jirachi up front. Please get me a Welder, because then I could just giant half it. Right, and then switch. Come on, Jirachi, get me a Welder. Please get me a Welder. Let me a welder, baby, please. Ah, oh, no, switching my candy, that's not good. Um, I guess switch if anything then. Okay, well, at least this way I get the, I get a nice little chip at. Um, at least this way I get a nice little chip damage for Entei, for Cinderace. There's a factory, in, there's a, Stadium in place, Cinderace gets both Cinderace get free retreat, which is perfectly fine. So let's see if I hit him with 120, he heals what 30, which makes it 90. Mm. Right, double giant bomb, which is nice. Um if super scoop up works. I go for it again. Cool. So scoop up works, bring Jirachi back, Cinderace goes up. Then Jirachi goes on the bench, bring Jirachi back up. Use that free retreat, might as well. Use that free retreat, get me something nice please. I'll take Giant Half at this point. I will take Giant Half at this point. Um, come on, give me something nice to use. Give me something nice. Quick ball, boss's orders. I guess I could do Quick Ball for, for Dedene. But then that's two for my Giant Bombs though. That's two of my giant bombs. How many welders is in discard? Zero. Absolutely zero. Um, okay. So get rid of giant bomb. Bring in the Denny. Get rid of everything else. Just give me a nice reset. I love the setup for this. The setup, the setting up for this is amazing. Like the combo, the, the streaks that you could do with this deck is amazing. Double switches, which is nice. Um, communications. Okay. Um, sure, I'm gonna say done. I'm gonna have to say done. Okay, then obviously Rillaboom's gonna take out Jirachi. I might have no choice but to put on Entei, do 120. Get, how much would that be in return? That would be one, be 90 damage, like I said, in return by the time my turn comes. Would I be able to take him out with that? Not really, even with the burn. Gonna be two. Oh no! No, yeah, I could. If I get Cinderace V Max, I could. But that's the only way, though. But then he's most likely gonna do that tropical hour get rid of Entei <sighs> gosh right at least we got this all right Cinderace can go off um, okay I want to check first if we have all three no we don't which means okay Cinderace V Max is in the prizes Rabu is in the prizes um, a welder is in the prizes I think a couple of energy wait one two three 11 I think one more energy is in the prize I think no we have all got energy skateboard is definitely in the prizes um use the money giant bombs left what are we missing there's something that there's something that I'm missing that I'm not seeing indeed he went into the discard but yeah I'm, there's something that I'm not seeing but okay um okay so next time he's definitely gonna 
He's just going to hit me back, isn't he? I mean, what would that be? 200. Actually, no. That would be the best idea. That would be the better idea, wouldn't it? Use Entei. Get the hit. I'm going to use Professor's Research. Because then I can. I just need a, a bunch of cards at my disposal, basically. Cinderace can be fine. Cinderace can be fine on his own. Um, I don't really need to worry. Because by that point, I can get Ravut. Um, Eldegoss. Eldegoss can get back Worldar, which is all fine. It's fine. It's fine. Perfectly fine. Perfectly fine. Um, let's see, even with Entei. Oh, if I had Giant Bomb, that would have been amazing. Ah, uh, okay, that would have put... Well, actually, no, because he's got two... He's got one of two things. He either hits me 150... Oh, he does his GX attack, and I can still get his hit. I think I can still get the hit. No. Oh, that means he has to. No, but then Life Force is just gonna get rid of his burn anyway. Ah, uh, that's gonna be an issue. I think he might have me actually. Yep. I think he might actually have me. This is gonna be very difficult. Okay. Yeah, this is gonna be very difficult. Right, Elder Ghost, get me Welder back. Double attach. I need giant half back. I know I've got giant halves in there still. Yep, there's giant half. Brilliant. Fantastic. Asking you shall receive. Um, right, Elder Ghost. I know there's a welder in here. Can't even lie to me, because I saw him. Right, uh, welder. Perfect. Um, there's no G yet. Well, I can great catch a Rowlet and Executor if he does decide to leave. But I don't think he will. And I'm running out of cards. I'm getting very slim on my cards. Being in mind, I've only just used one Welder this entire game. Which is going to put me in a very difficult situation. Alright, uh, right, there's another Giant Half. There's Jirachi. Might as well set up the other Cinderace. Because, might as well. Um, I think most likely he's probably gonna do tropical hour now. Most likely, right? That's the burn. If he doesn't go heads, then of course it would. Um, right. See, so uh, this uh, this is really dependent now on what comes what comes next. It has to be. It's got to be well though it has to be well though so how much damage can Rillaboom do all together 130 there's 50 more discards up to three that makes it 150 extra 280 which means he can hit 280 it won't knock out cinderace counter it will knock out Rillaboom. no it won't 280 plus the 30 will make it 310 giant bomb though would have made it easier now the only problem oh god i'm out of a line up <laughs> okay. Well, if he doesn't add weakness energy, I can easily take him. Okay, that's perfectly fine. Right, this cost three energy does two hundred eighty. I can either. Okay, I've got one or two choices now. I can either use Great Catcher, snuff out Rowlet and Lone Executor, get rid of them, or I can do Counter right now and get out Rillaboom, take my three prizes. But then that means Rowlet and Lone Executor is going to come back and get me, and I don't think I have the energy, or I don't think I have the damage to get him unless I get Cinderace V Max from this prize from this prize draw. Um. <sighs> Right, so first off, use Indeedy to heal up Cinderace. Then Mallow and Lana. I'm, I think... Ah, oh, see, it's just it's a gamble at this point, because I've used all my switches, which means I need to hope and pray that I'm just going to get my escape board. That's literally the whole thing I have to worry about now, is that all I have to worry about is will I get a skateboard if I pop Mallow and Lana? Or I could play it safe... Go to Cinderace and get free retreat and just hit back anyway, which I might just do. I might just have to do that actually. So Malo and Lana, discard that, get rid of Great Catcher and a Fire Energy, I suppose. 
I'm gonna catch her on a fire energy because I might need to keep that. 280, which will be nowhere near enough. It has to be Cinderace Speed Max. It has to be. Right, cool. If I had Cinder if I had normal Cinderace, this would have been a lot easier, but I don't, unfortunately. Um, right, cool. So I guess just hit the counter, I suppose, because that's the only thing that's going to be... Well, I mean, Max Parable will get the one hit anyway, but I know counter is just going to be a lot easier, so... So, right, so just hit him back. 620, look at that. 620 damage, come on, Cinderace V Max, you got to give me them. you got to give me Cinderace V Max. It's Rabu, which is fine, but I think that's going to take too long in this late of the game. Being in mind, I haven't even found Skull Bunny yet. Fire Crystal, and... Oh gosh, please let this be Cinderace. Come on, please let this be Cinderace. Quick ball. Nope. Alright. Now, I need to get... Oh gosh, yeah. Now, I definitely need to get... Um, that's all my energy gone. That is literally all my energy. Back in the deck. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. We can, we can work around with this. Can work around with this. How much damage do I need? I need 200. Skateboard. Okay, brilliant. Fantastic. Um, right, first off, Fire Crystal. If there's boss's orders, I'm so screwed. Because he can literally. I'm, I'm playing a gamble right now, basically. Because if I do Quick Ball, I'm going to say, no, keep, keep Mana Manana because I feel like I'm going to need them. I feel like I'm definitely going to need it. Right, get Score Bunny first. The only one that could pretty much tank that hit good enough is Score Bunny, is uh, Baby Cinderace. So keep that there. Jirachi, you need, you owe me a Welder, man. You owe me a Welder. Come on. Come on, Jirachi. You owe me a Welder. There we go. Right, on Cinderace, I can tank a hit from Cin... I can tank a hit at least one, but then I have Malo and Lana anyway. Uh, let's see. So put that on Cinderace, then come on, attach two. All right, draw, draw, draw. Boss's orders, which is nice, but I can't. Well, I mean, he hasn't picked up his real, his other Rillaboom, which is a, which is a good sign. Um, so wait, sign so on. So two hundred eighty. I mean, two hundred eighty minus thirty would be two fifty. I can pretty much two hit him here, unless he pulls off another Malo and Lana, then I'll be in trouble. And I don't really have another Pokemon that, that can tank it properly. If he has boss's orders, he can literally pick Jirachi or Score Bunny right now, and he's one. Um, okay. If he doesn't, then I've got it. Okay, there's the other brother room. At this point, you don't need all the energy because you've hit Tropical Hour anyway. But, okay. Well, I mean, no, that's it. That's our tip. Oh, no, but then that's two prizes. Ah, uh, that's two prizes. I need him evolved. I need Rillaboom V evolved because I'm not going to be able to take the two prizes. I'm not going to win with two prizes compared to that, compared to a two-hit KO that he's going to do to me. I'm happy that he got rid of his GX attack at this point. Because that's just that just puts a whole lot of stress off me. But I don't have the I can't I can't get him that well. Oh my god, is that it? Did he try and retreat? Oh my god, then then that's it. Ooh, then that's it. All I have to do is do boss's orders and snuff it and snuff out Rallo Lonely Take It All. GG? Well played, dude. You had me. I got, I got really, really worried. I got really, really worried for a second. Oh, boss's orders. Thank you. And then Crimson Legs. Finish this off. Yes. Oh, my gosh. That scared me half to death. Right. Um, I'm going to say announcement time because that was a pretty fun match, actually. Right. Cinderace V Max. I really like it. I actually really like it a lot. I love the combination of just using Cinderace and the whole healing mechanics. Because the whole point of Cinderace V Max, right, is that whatever you got hit with, you can dish back plus extra. It doesn't say anything about whatever your damage is, you give back. 
because then that would make it kind of overpowered but not really because then 310 but yeah actually it might make it a bit overpowered because then the max you could hit is 340 plus hidden extras would just make it completely over overpowered in my opinion but yeah I love the whole factor of like you can heal Cinderace before you attack with it and you still do a bunch of damage anyway Because it say like what we did then we use Malo and Lana healed 120 Indeed he heals uh, 20 if you got both of them on the bench that's 40 you heal 160 You basically heal his half of his HP which is great because many Pokemon is gonna hit over half Which is great and it turns it into a two possibly three hit KO which is amazing like I really really like that um, but yeah, just Cinderace can hit back really, really hard. I'm surprised I've not seen many people use Cinderace VMAX as much as I would have loved to see. It's just the whole premise. I guess the whole premise would be just... It, it's it's risky. Because there are cards that can take out Cinderace very, very nicely. Like, for example, when we had the Tropical Hour attack put onto us, it was a bit stressful because we obviously lost it. We had to rely on Welder a lot, which has kind of been my problem as of late with Fire Decks. It's relying too much on welder to do things and if you can't get any of those welders or you have no choice but discard like one or two of them it puts you in a really really tough spot and i don't know it's just really weird i've been i used to love having fire decks when welder came out i used to love it but now it's just it, it's a bit weirder because i think we're just kind of too comfortable with welder with fire decks it's just relying on it too much and obviously like i know that's why i've kept cinderace there as well because we don't need to rely on welder for uh, baby cinderace we literally just swap it out if we need to heal cinderace up a bit more and cinderace can literally do a nice 190 which would take out pretty much any basic gx and literally a good amount of v pokemon like i know more pico would get would get done celebi would get done it's a good card to have just a little like one-off big puncher for one prize as well is amazing and it sets up as well for Cinderace V Max. If you don't want to do counter, you do Max Parable. For 190, you just hit 380. That's pretty much a 2 KO on pretty much the entire board, which again, I have no issue with whatsoever. Um, but other than that, I just there's nothing really much, much else I could say. The item cards are amazing to work with. Um, the whole premise of like using Jirachi to find Wilder is great and all. Uh, the Dene again for draw, having a DD to heal, everything. I just can't really complain, really. Um, but it, of course, if you guys do find anything that I should take out, let me know. If you guys think I should um, put anything in, uh, let me know. If you guys think I should make any other deck that you want to see, let me know in the comments. I'll be more than happy to try it out. But of course, guys, if you enjoyed, always click like and always click on the video. You guys are always welcome back, and I'll see you all in the next video. All right, guys, take care, and I'll see you all later. Okay, bye!